The tree of 40 fruit is a single fruit tree that grows over 40 different types of stone fruit, including peaches, plums, apricots, nectarines, cherries, and almonds. The idea came from just sort of a fascination with the process of grafting. When I'd seen it done as a child, it was Dr. Seuss and Frankenstein and just about everything fantastic. I started traveling around central New York and New York State to look for different varieties of stone fruit. Eventually I was able to find these different heirloom and antique varieties, but they are very rare, so I would bring them back here to my nursery, graft them onto a tree so that I could continue to use them. Now I have a huge collection of plums and apricots. Through the project, I've, I've worked with a lot of growers, and at first they didn't understand it because they were, why would you want to have a tree with that many different fruit on it? You would have to go back over and over to continue to harvest all the fruit. The project is, for me, always an art project. I was really interested in the idea of a hoax in terms of you know, hoax transforms reality. Part of the idea for the Tree of 40 Fruit was to plant them in locations that people would sort of stumble upon. Once they happened upon one of these trees, they would start to question, why are the leaves shaped differently? Why are they different colors? And then in summer, when you would see all of these different fruit growing on them, and of course in spring when they blossom in different colors. It is an artwork. When I first started, I just sort of grafted the branches on. So each variety blossoms at a slightly different time. And I had a tree that blossomed all on one side, but looked dead on the other. From that point on, I created a timeline of when all of these different varieties blossom in relationship to each other. So I could essentially sculpt how the tree would blossom. For each of the trees, I keep a map, essentially, or a diagram of the tree. Yeah, it takes a really long time. I start a tree and I let it grow for about three years. And at that point, I can come in and start to graft onto those branches. Those four branches become eight. The next year, eight becomes 16, 16 becomes 32. It's essentially like an eight to nine year process. Essentially what you're doing with this clear plastic is you're creating a greenhouse uh, around the graft. And so what it'll do is all that humidity helps the graft heal in. The first tree was planted in 2011 and it has the 40 varieties, but I anticipate it'll be about three or four years before it's at that peak and, and then peak blossom. Unlike any other artworks that, that I've made, these things continuously evolve. I think one of the reasons why I've been able to keep it going for so long is that every year it's something new. And when you come out here and the trees are all in blossom, it's really kind of an amazing experience. Plus you get fruit all summer. <laughs>